Hi all, welcome to Night Rips. And time for a new product, a new sport, and a new way of doing things. The new product, new sport would be, this would be 2022 Panini Select WWE, or as we used to call it whenever I was growing up, wrestling. But I don't know this product very well. I, I do watch a little bit of wrestling, but I'm back from the days when you know, you had, you know, the American Dream, you had the Nature Boy wrestling on WTBS and a little bit of WWF, but I decided, let me go ahead and call in a member of my familia to, who has, actually has a little bit more knowledge of this. Let me introduce you to Birdie Boogie. Hey everybody, this is Birdie Boogie. Uh, did YouTube for a little bit, but mainly just on Twitter now. Um, you know, it wouldn't be right if I wasn't plugging my stuff. So Birdie Boogie TV is the Twitter name. Um, I'm actually getting back into wrestling uh, now that Triple H is taking over and the product is going back to what I enjoyed the most, which was the black and gold era of NXT. Um, so what better way to get back into it than opening up uh, a new product? So Panini now recently taking over the WWE license. Uh, this is their third product. So we had Prism, we had Revolution, and now we have Select. Uh, the big thing about this product is this man right here, Cody Rhodes, his first WWE card since coming back from AEW. So, uh, you know, enough time talking about it. Let's go ahead and rip it. So just get it right in there. And while he's opening that up, let me go ahead and invite you to join the channel. Go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button there below as I try to find my finger on it. And go ahead and hit notify. See, notified when I put stuff up because now you never know what I'm going to put up. So we get two autographs and one mem per box. Um, one thing I'm really liking about the mem this in this product compared to a lot of wrestling products is, you know, we all know in baseball, it's very common to get what we call white napkins. Um, with wrestling, it's just a lot of black t-shirts. Uh, but they're actually are go looking for some there's some multicolored relics that we can find some multicolored t-shirts which is better than just the all black uh, and then of course there are the ring mats as well let's go ahead and get this open how many cards is in each pack uh, so it's going to be five cards per pack and we are going to start off with the great Kali, sasha banks Liv Morgan, and we have a silver Hulk Hogan. Oh, uh, what's awesome about this Hulk Hogan is when is the last time you've really seen a card of Hulk Hogan, either not in Hollywood Hulk Hogan, NWO, or wearing the red and gold, all white there. So a silver Hulk Hogan, and then we have a Beth Phoenix premier level. All right, what are you going to sleeve? Uh, let's sleeve up the, the Hogan. All right. See, I don't get assistance when I write I rip cards, so this is a bonus. All right. Let's keep it rocking. Ooh, we Ooh. some color. We, we do have some color. It looks like it's going to be a tri-color. One thing I've noticed is that uh, all of the tri-colors have the spacer in front of them, which is what we look like we have here. But here's a nice rookie, Braun Breaker. The Macho Man, Randy Savage. Oh, something backwards We here. do have something backwards, so it isn't a spacer. Oh, wow. So we... Uh, we have a multicolor, uh, or tricolor, excuse me, Drew McIntyre. Uh, looks like we have is that Premier Level Ridge Holland. All righty, and let's see. I could feel in the back. This is, well, we can tell by thickness this is going to be a mem. Maybe we'll get lucky. It'll be a mem auto. It's just it SmackDown autograph oh. Jay Uso, twelve of twenty-five. Oh, wow. 12 of 25 autograph memorabilia. There you go. Is that, is that, is that, that is, Matt or? No, that's that's t-shirt. Tri-color t-shirt there. Oh, wow. A little bit. We got a red. We got some gray. We got some white. Member of the Bloodline, Jay Uso. That's the tie-dye out of 25. Wow. Starting that's awesome. off hot. That's awesome. Starting off hot. That's a thick car, too. We, can, we, can, we can't complain about that here. Um, and that's one thing that I'm really liking now that I'm getting into more collecting wrestling is just the prices of products compared to the other sports I'm into, baseball, football. Um, so obviously football first off the line just came out for select at $1,000 a box. Um, this one, when I got it, was $220. Um, the prices have just dropped from there. I think you can get it now for around $160, $170. Um, so it's definitely nice being able to actually afford some product. 
All right, let's keep it rolling. We have Blair Davenport. Looks like we have a, a scope coming up. We have The Undertaker. We have a Kofi Kingston Phenomenon card. Very pretty. Is that a number card? I know. No, that's just going to be a base there, Kofi. But here's a JC Jane Scope. She just made her SmackDown debut uh, last night at the time of recording. Uh, scopes are going to be non numbered, but I can't complain about that. Nice. And then a Queen Zelina Premier Level. Of course, standard chrome's got to be a little bit curved there. Can't be flat. Yeah, Select is just a gorgeous product. And it's nice to see with WWE. One thing that's nice as well is obviously with Select, there are the four different types. There's Premier Level, Concourse, Ringside. Um, there's one that's retail exclusive, I don't remember. But they actually have different pictures for all four, which is a little bit nice. It's not just a different design. The picture is different as well. Looks like we definitely have some color coming up here. Uh, we have The Rock. We have Farouk. We have Michael Cole. And we have a green Dominique Mysterio. The green actually matches his gear. Ooh, real pretty there. Jersey match. Yeah, can't, can't complain about that. Uh, that's going to be 11 of 49. Dominique nice. Mysterio. And then we have Becky Lynch, premier level. So overall, we're doing well on our numbered cards right now. Obviously, we have the, the tie-dye Jey Uso to 25. We have the Dominique Mysterio to 49. Just going to get myself a little bit more organized here. All right, let's keep on rolling. Yeah, I was not expecting Mem Auto, but we will not complain about it. And a short print Mem Auto, that's yeah. the nice thing. Out of 25, I don't I don't pull stuff that, that low that often. So. I mean, once again, that is an advantage of wrestling, is the print count is going to be less. So mm -hmm. your your chances of, oh, we definitely it's, have something here. It's either something or a spacer, I don't know. Um, I'm thinking it might be a spacer. I'm seeing, I'm seeing a tricolor. Uh, we have Gigi Dolan. Just made her SmackDown debut last night. Time of recording. Charlotte Flair. Alexa Bliss. There's our spacer. Uh, and then there's a tri-color Jinder Mahal. I mean, just gorgeous cards, gorgeous pictures. Uh, I can't tell who he has. Yeah, I can't figure it out. <laughs> uh, and then Xavier Woods, premier level. Fun fact for the viewers at home, Xavier Woods and I actually went to the same high school. Uh, our, our rival high school actually had Cody Rhodes go there uh, and Lita as well. So never never a shortage of wrestlers in Georgia. Yeah. Plus you trained with Theory. You trained with, well, A.R. Fox, T.T. Marshall. Fryer, yeah. Rookie Veer Mahan. Oh, it looks like we have something coming up. Uh, we have Hall of Fame selections, the Macho Man. Uh, we have it's a, white. It's a white Kofi Kingston. Uh, and that is going to be numbered out of 99. Nice. So another short print, white Kofi Kingston there. And John Cena, premier level. Great photo of Cena there. Now, what, you'd have pulled a mem auto of Cena. No, I, would, I wouldn't have minded that. But, you know, never, never a problem getting a member of the bloodline. Is it Jay or Jimmy that's married to Naomi? Uh, that's a good question that I don't know the answer to. <laughs> uh, let's see if... Oh, it looks like we have something backwards coming up. Solo Sokoa rookie. Uh, we have Rhea Ripley. Let's looks like we have a silver Mako Satamura. Uh, Seth freaking Rollins premier level. And let's see who is the next auto. I think that's going to be AJ Styles based on AJS Raw. Oh, that is AJ Styles. Another Georgia boy. Let's turn around and see that auto. Great auto. Look at that. That is. Wow, he actually even kept it. In the, I mean, he barely kept it in the sticker. But he, look at that. He, he kept it on the sticker. Wow. And it's numbered, no number? Yeah, no number. But, I mean, it's AJ Styles. You can't complain about oh, AJ yeah. Styles. That's a, that's a future Hall of Famer right there. Gorgeous. All right. Let's keep on going. So, something I'm I'm in, I'm intrigued about now is so it's two autographs and one mem does that count as both or will we get mm. an extra auto an extra mem we'll see good point i mean so far we can't complain about this box that's for sure all right we have some thickness we have butch now what's interesting about this product is butch bases are just butch but his auto is pete dunn so 
Um, watch out if you're getting into brakes. Uh, make sure if you get Butch or Pete done that you're getting both. Uh, looks like we have a tricolor coming up. We have Butch, Jinder Mahal, rookie Tony D'Angelo. Spacer. Another spacer and a tricolor. Tony D'Angelo. Tony D'Angelo <laughs> rookie. Awesome. Part of the new NXT. We also have Edge Premier Level. Yeah, Jay Uso and AJ Styles. That's two Hall of Famers right there. Or future Hall of Famers, that is. Keep on rolling. All right, looks like we have some color coming. Oh, looks like we have a silver coming up. We have rookie Joe Gacy. We have Goldberg. Xavier Woods. Now, we saw the Xavier earlier, the premier level. There's, you know, the normal photo right there. We have a silver Jimmy Hart. Uh, and then we have a premier level Indy Hartwell, the Leah there. Yeah, Indy Wrestling. She's been teasing that she'll be coming to Raw. I'm hoping to see it. I'm also hoping to see... Gargano and Candace come back to WWE, uh, but only time will tell. Io Shirai just made her call up to the main roster. Looks like we have some more color coming just, up here. Uh, got her old name. Yeah, so now Io Sky, of course. Uh, we have Edge. Ooh, we have neat. a select NXT 2.0, Jordan Devlin. Uh, and we have a blue Kushida here. Uh, Kushida... Uh, no longer with the company, uh, but that's going to be numbered to two ninety nine. Mm. So if you're going to get a high numbered one, let's make it somebody who's not with the company anymore. So here's going to be your rarest um, version of your base cards here. So this is a ringside Xavier Woods. So as you can see here, different pictures throughout, which is really nice. Not reusing the same photos over and over again. We have two packs left. some thickness that means that mem auto might have not been it yeah because it doesn't look like we have a tricolor coming up so we have uh roman reigns tribal chief we have maurice well, we're gonna go around we have a silver rob van dam we have uh premier level dolph ziggler all righty and then looks like this will be the mem here and we'll get lucky. Pull another Mem Auto. How nice would that be? BLS. BLS. I'm going to guess Alexa Bliss. Let's see. Oh, Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley. And there you go. All black t-shirt. But once again, though, when we already pulled a Mem Auto that was a tricolor Mem, we can't complain about this. There's Bobby Lashley there. Pretty awesome photo of him. The Almighty. There's Maurice. All right, last Pat Mojo. Let's pull. Let's pull Cody Rhodes. He only has a ringside card, so definitely rarer to pull. But I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. All right, John Cena. Pretty awesome photo there. It looks like he's with Booker T. Looks like we do have some color coming up. We have Shawn Michaels. Gonna reach around over here. We've had so many good pulls. We're running out of space here. Global Icons, Hacksaw Jim Duggan just beat Cancer. Love that for him. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, ooh, ooh, Blue Oscar. Ooh, that's pretty. Blue Oscar. Let's check out what we have here. That's going to be numbered to 199, Blue Oscar, and that is Premier Level. That's nice. And then here is actually one of my favorite wrestlers, um, Candice LeRae, and I believe that is a ringside Candice LeRae. So love that. Hoping she makes her return to WWE. Um, but... As you can see here, uh, the hits were a plenty. Uh, we had a low number, Dominique Mysterio. We had a Jey Uso, really low number, tie dye Jey Uso to 25. Styles Auto, uh, Kushida, light blue, Asuka, dark blue. I mean, Kofi White. You can't complain about it. Uh, select. There's also, like I said, a whole set of base cards that are only retail exclusive. So be on the look for it to retail as well. But I like Select. I might get another box of it. But of course, NXT Panini is coming out as well. So the future is looking bright with wrestling cards and Panini. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to open up some more on this channel. Yep. I'm definitely going to be trying to get my hands on some of these blasters. Because like, like Bertie said, I almost called it your real name. <laughs> like Bertie said, uh, you know, there is a set that's only in the, the retail. And so I actually pulled a Panini Select box the other day, but it was UFC. So it's like, ah, yeah, because I don't think the Panini uh, Blasters are out yet. So 
definitely a fun rip. Definitely going to be having Birdie come join the channel every once in a while. So you're not just going to hear me. And with that being said, definitely want to make sure y'all do go ahead and subscribe to the channel. We are going to start opening up some different things, you know, things like box wars and you name it. We're going to do it. And since he lives just down the road from me and he is family, we might as well enjoy this. So I hope you enjoyed the channel. Make sure you subscribe, hitting that subscribe button below and hitting the notify bell. Also, if you got to like the video, because this is a brand new thing, and this was an awesome rip, and I appreciate Bertie, you know, sharing it with us. Also, any comments, drop in the comment section below. We'd love to hear from you. But as always, appreciate you taking the time to watch something like this. It's, this is fun. And until next time, bye now.